much our MP each, I will go and debate. It is a debater, but it has to come from you. Hi guys, it's a girl a lot times, also known as a girl of a Z, girl from Zambia. If you're new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe so that each time I upload videos, you will be notified that Gelo Wapa Z posts a Boca video. Thank you. Thank you so much for more than 71,300 subscribers. Na Tuotela Sana. In this video, I will be sharing with you a video that has been uploaded on Facebook where Madam Margaret Mwanakatwe shows desperation with regards to bill 10 well she is a former minister finance minister of zambia and the way she was speaking her english sounds good but the way she was articulating the whole issue of bill 10 it was muffled and embarrassing to watch i am absolutely embarrassed to watch this and to share this with you but before i make my comments watch this video for mp to go back to council what did just happen we're not there bill 10 is bringing the mp back to be part of the council because the mp knows best what is good for that constituency most of them will come back with visa seed and let me tell you, Bill 10, right it down, right it down. No, politicize too much. Why come up a deputy minister? It's not just Sapo, could be a deputy minister. It's not just Sapo. Why come a deputy minister, deputy minister? It's not just Sapo. As PF, we've taken it out. Who come by that coalition government? It's not just Sapo. It's by 50 plus one. So you guys have to wisen up. That the opposition are playing us. They are playing us. And you've got to wake up. That Bill 10. Bill 10. Chikalunza. Na popularity na izabu na pansi. There's nothing sinister about Bill 10. In fact, what I'd like to see, Chikangala saw one day, soon, Mukani Fuse ma Fuse a Bill 10. Mikamu Yang Ken. That there's nothing sinister. About building. It's important. It's important that we understand what Bill Ten is doing and not doing. In fact, I'm surprised that I haven't had one question. Could the MP what? Bill 10. Bill 10 is bringing women into parliament without standing at the moment in the moment in the vote campaign. Bringing women. It's bringing youth without standing. The percentage. So many youth. So many women. And so many disabled. That's what Bill 10 is doing. Can you throw that away? No. So, if you actually do it, no one did it. Now, 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 we sat for more than 20 days. Ingo Kamara Wandu. Voi Patina Chosa. Munga Coalition. Chitenjiva Deputy Minister. Tina Chosa. Zambia is a Christian nation. Tina Chosa. Yes. Tina Chosa. Preambo. Kulibay Choa Ipa Mbiu Ten. Nati Chiri Mo Niu Zemi. So that now, as I go back to vote, I can carry your voice. Okay? I can carry your voice. Because it's very, very important that we go through with this bill. Don't forget what happened to Bill of Rights. What happened? Eh? When I said the campaign? Yes. Huh? When I said the campaign? In Agua. Yes. In Agua. Referendum. In Agua. And the same can happen if we don't get this thing right. If there's anything in there, 
that you are worry about, worrying about, please let me know. I'm your MP. Huh? I'm your MP. So that we are here. MP, I am MP. The banker says, "Mwanje ba cha o MP." Ichi. Ah, we go and debate. She's a debater, but it has to come from you. It has to come from you. That's why ni kamba. I mean, ni kamba. Ni kadi papa makanse la pacha. MP ba nam chosa. Okay. is going to allow the MP to sit on the council. My name. Sit all pa CDF, pa nali the MP. And gena manje mu new act. That's why I'm able to be a member of CDF and I can influence CDF. Before, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I remember so many of them. I said, I'm going to go to the police post. We haven't finished. I sent people around last week to go and look at my projects. I found my small police post in Lua. It's not finished. But I'm able to do that now because I'm now able to sit on the CDF committee. Before that, I couldn't do that. Now with Bill 10, I'll be able to sit on the council. Mwambela? Nikupanga, wamele muka, wamele mutanda ulata. Nimukambira nkumu. But kumukambira nkumu, I need you to talk to me all the time. All the time, unikambisa. Nima vela buino. Then I can also do things. If I don't hear from you, I'm just hearing from... Wamele, awa, wamele, awa, weka, weka. Are you not part of the PF? Yeah. Yeah. Part and parcel. So, you can be sad. Huh? You can be sad. Timba, Bill 10 is coming. Next week, Tinge is a foot Bill 10. Okay? We're going to make sure that we pass the right laws for you. That's why you voted us, PF, as your lawmakers. We're going to pass the right laws for you. And if the laws are wrong, you are the people to tell me. MP, ah, 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 her behavior seems to be irrational. I don't think she's with it. Um, you know, we've seen her having alcoholic problems before in the public and images of her have circulated across social media. And she just seems like a desperate woman who wants, you know, position in the Patriotic Front uh, Party and obviously their government next year. And she's preaching about Bill 10, Bill 10 this, and the people she's talking about <laughs> Bill 10 to have no idea what Bill 10 is. And those are the ministers of Zambia, some of them that don't even know what they're talking about and still want to be in position and don't want to give a chance to the young ones to take positions in government. Well, Madam Manakatwe, I'm here to tell you this. Um, nobody is accepting bill 10 except you guys because it favors you and we the young people of zambia we are the generation of zambia the future starts now not five years or ten years when you're 65 or 70 uh -uh. now this is when we want to be part of the zambian government as well and be given an opportunity to speak things and also to change things according to how we know things should be done and not selfishly acquiring wealth according to most of you guys so i thought let me just share with you and uh, laugh with me as i share our former minister you know we've seen so many of them clowning in parliament and just when they have to make speeches or maybe when they are invited to speak at different tv stations they can't even express themselves well. Her English was good, but her speech was useless. Absolutely rubbish. I wanted you to waste your time the same way I wasted my time. It has actually pained me that I listened to this nonsense. Like, she doesn't even make sense. What, what is she saying? Maybe if you understand, you can explain to me in the comment section below. But I just thought her 
speech was utterly rubbish. And don't get me wrong, Margaret Monacato is a very intelligent woman. Uh, she's worked as a director of Barclays Bank across Africa. And she was doing well in that sector until she began politics where she lost it. I don't know how she lost it, but her character has just suddenly changed. We've seen her behaving so strange, drinking alcohol, turning up at meetings, drunk, absolutely drunk. And, you know, in as much as she may be intelligent, she maybe needs to take a, you know, a sit back. She really needs to take a sit back away from politics and reevaluate her life. She can be a consultant and, you know, be teaching the young ones on what they can do next. Her time is gone. There was a time when she was trending. People would talk about her. She was an inspiring woman. But of late, I don't even know what to, you know, talk about her honestly. Like, I'm not really inspired by her character these days. And also, uh, for those of you who don't know what Bill 10 is, Bill 10 is basically a new bill that the current government under the Patriotic Front want to bring into as a part of a constitution of Zambia that will enable them to stay for the next, you know, 10 years or so. But we, the youth of Zambia, are saying no to Bill 10. And it also depends on two uh, UPND members of parliament if they accept bill 10 then it means the bill will be passed on but so far it's a bash bill 10 the young people say no we want democracy to carry on if you want to learn more about bill 10 i will link the video down below for you to watch it and then you understand what bill 10 really is thanks for watching my youtube channel it's a girl Lama Tams, also known as gelo said see you on my next video I love you guys. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button and follow me on all social media platforms. It's simply at Lulu Motors.